Right, hello everyone. I hope you're all well and welcome back again to Warren's Team Talk. Uh, it's my second video today, so I'm really going for it today. Um, I just thought it was high time that I'll give you a update about the um, um, FA Cup third round draw which took place and how it relates to um, the how it relates to the Warren's Team Talk selection. So that's what we're going to be doing today and having a quick look at the third round draw. So here we go. I hope you're all well anyway and having a great day. Please don't forget to put a like on the video. Please don't forget to share it around with as many different people as you possibly can. And also... Um, Please don't forget to take care of each other and be kind to one another and share some love around the world, especially at the moment when we seem to be um, slipping into another uh, cesspit of absolute madness and craziness with this new COVID variant that's going around. And, yeah, let's support each other and help each other get through it. Anyway, so... On with the show, as they say. Um, so, the Warrens team talk selection, as you probably all know, is Rotherham United. Um, they defeated Stockport County by a goal to nil in the second round to um, win the honour, um, the very great honour of carrying the Warrens team talk banner into the third round. Um, and in the third round, they were drawn to play um, Queen's Park Rangers at Loftus Road on Saturday the 8th of January at 3 o'clock. And that would be quite a game, I'm sure. It would be a massive day out for the Rotherham fans. I'm sure they're absolutely looking forward to it. And I'm sure that if they're hoping to be able to play them again next season in the Championship. They're sitting proud and loud at the top of the uh, League One. So, yeah, there you go. Um, I'll be covering that on Saturday the 8th of January um, in my Match Day Live programme, a special FA Cup version of the Match Day Live. So I'm sure that's going to be wild. And um, obviously, because Rotherham United are the Warrens Team Talk selection, they will be... I will be fully supporting Rotherham and getting behind them and cheering them on. So, yeah, um, please remember to come and join me for that on Saturday the 8th of January because it's going to be amazing. FA Cup third round day is a very, very special day in the football calendar. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be amazing. Anyway, so here is the full third round draw. Uh, this is the first 16 ties. Um, the first game of the of the third round will be taking place on Friday the 7th of January at 8 o'clock between Swindon Town and Manchester City. And then the rest of the draw is Bristol City against Fulham, Burnley against Huddersfield Town. Sorry. What am I talking about? Yeah, Swindon, yeah. Bristol City against Fulham, Burnley against Huddersfield Town. Coventry City against Derby County, Hartlepool against Blackpool, Mansfield against Mansfield Town against Middlesbrough, Millwall against Crystal Palace, Barnsley against Barrow, Borehamwood v AFC Wimbledon, Kidderminster Harriers against Reading, Leicester City against Watford, Newcastle United against Cambridge United. Peterborough United against Bristol Rovers, Port Vale against Brentford, Queen's Park Rangers against Rotherham United, as we already talked about, West Bromwich Albion against Brighton and Hove Albion, and um, Wigan Athletic against Blackburn Rovers. And then those, all those games will be kicking off at 3 o'clock, right? And then at half past five, we've got two, one, two, three, four, five, five games, I think, that are kicking off uh, at half past five on Saturday the 8th of January. 
And those are Birmingham City against Plymouth Argyle, Chelsea against Chesterfield, Hull City v Everton, Swansea City against Southampton, Yeovil Town against AFC Bournemouth. And then on Sunday, the first there's a number of games on the Sunday. The first one of those at half past 12 is Luton Town against Harrogate Town. And the next game at 2 o'clock um, on Sunday, the 9th of January, it's a 2 o'clock kickoff. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six of those. And the first one of those is Cardiff against Preston North End, Cholton versus Norwich City, Liverpool against Shrewsbury Town, Stoke City v Leighton Orient, Tottenham Hotspur against Morecambe, Wolverhampton Wanderers against Sheffield United. And then 2.15, we have West Ham against Leeds United. West Ham United against Leeds United. And then at 5.15, we've got Nottingham Forest against Arsenal. And then on the Monday, Monday the 10th of January, at 7.55pm, we have Manchester United against Aston Villa. So there's some great ties there. Ones that jump out to me are the Manchester United and Aston Villa game and um, Wolves against Sheffield United. Obviously, the Rotherham and QPR game. Um, Chelsea against Chesterfield. Um, and what else have we got there that looks exciting? Cholton against Norwich City. Um and Swindon Town against Manchester City. Um, and Newcastle United against Cambridge United. And yeah, so there's some great ties there, as I say. So don't forget to come and join me, like I say, on Saturday, the 8th of January when I'll be doing a special match day live for the FA Cup third round day. Um, That's going to be absolutely amazing. Please put your comments in the comment section of the video, telling me what you think about the third round draw, what games are jumping out at you, which games you're really looking forward to seeing. Um, There's quite a number of really intriguing ties there, really exciting ones, I think. Um, so it's enough, more than enough to be wetting people's appetites, I guess. And I hope so anyway. And yeah, so that's the end of my video. Please don't forget to put a like on the video. Please don't forget to share the video around with as many different people as you possibly can. And also, um, please remember to subscribe to my channel. It's completely free. You don't have to pay for it. And it only takes a second to subscribe. And also, make sure you hit the notification bell as well. Because the notification bell will let you know any time that I upload a new video to YouTube. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, and um, I hope that you're all okay and having a great day. And... You enjoy the rest of your day. Like I said before, please stay safe. Please follow the government guidelines. And please remember to share some love and kindness around the world and keep talking um, because it really does help. And if you're suffering, and I hope that you're not, please reach out and try and get some help. It really can help if you just pick up the phone and have a chat with someone. Anyway, I hope that you're all well. Please take care, and I look forward to seeing you all again soon. Thanks a lot, guys. Take care. That's it for now. Bye.